There is no such thing as the perfect life. Sometimes bad things will happen to you, or even worse. Do you want to know what the definition of tragedy is? Having to pay over a hundred pounds for a single plastic figure. With Skylanders, while the plot overall is pretty basic, some Skylanders really do have really sad new backstories. And today, I want to discuss to you guys about my top 5 most tragic Skylanders backstories. I hope it's the best bus to the Portal Master's room, eh? Neat. I'm really sorry, but... Who are you? Well, how rude! I thought I was your favorite. Oh wait, you're Ghost Roaster, aren't you? Yeah, it's me, Ghost Roaster, one of the original 32. I eat ghouls, so don't let me coming after you. Get out. Oh, this video is supposed to be taken seriously. Well, meanwhile, can I play the even better into the corner while I wait? Okay, go ahead, but just. Please turn the volume down to zero because I don't like background noise when I'm recording. Thank you. At number five, we have Hex. Back when she was younger, Hex was a rather promising young magician. This caught the attention of Malifor, who wanted her power desperately. After being hunted by Malifor many times, Hex thought enough was enough. She decided to face Malifor by herself. Hex emerged victorious, but at a price. She has become an elf of the undead. Moody, bitter, angry, no longer being able to feel joy or happiness. And even worse, her arms keep breaking off. Fried Rider didn't get a repose, and even his limbs doesn't detach easily. Oh yeah, and Skylanders Academy Hex was a pretty bad incarnation of her, so that adds extra 10 sad points. Next up, we have Gilgrunt. During one of his tours of duty as a soldier, he came across a mermaid, and fell in love with her. And then she was captured by pirates. And then Master Eon forced, I'm sorry, I mean convinced Gilgrunt to join the Skylanders. Unfortunately, Activision was so obsessed with Gilgrunt that they reposed him many, 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 many times. And even after being in many active tours of duty, I'm not sure if Gilgrunt even found his mermaid girlfriend. Oh wait, he has found his mermaid girlfriend? Number 3 is Chain Reaction. Because the Skylander boy and girl doesn't know how to look after Skylanders properly. Number two is Brocket. Okay, now admittedly, finding out that your grandfather is missing can be pretty heartbreaking, especially since Brocket's grandfather was the person who got her into engineering. That relatability runs completely dry when you find out that her moveset is utter garbage, and you also find out that 98% of the Skylanders community really hates her. And why does she look like Coraline in that picture? And now, ladies and gentlemen, it is time for the most broken, the most saddest, and the most tragic scandal. And that scandal. <laughs> you absolute fool! Really, Ghost Roaster? Now? Can't you see I'm almost finished? <laughs> I've been waiting for this exact moment to join the Skylanders rap game. I'm sorry, but I don't know how rapping has got to do anything with tragedy. Okay, so you see, I bought me to rap, this out a whole phenomenon, and then Riptide, not long after, made his own rap. So it's about time that I make my own representing this channel. Well, I guess it could be a lot worse. And the rap is called Total darkness. Wait, that makes me sound like a bad guy. Ah, screw it! Let's just get ahead! Once I was one of the best chefs of Skylands, my team 
used to do was one of my greatest achievements. But when I was looking for ingredients, I fell off some cliff. And now I've turned to a monster. What a detriment. I got super hungry for reasons unknown. I ate an entire village of harmless scepters. I was then changed up forever to be alone. Master Eon made me a Skylander. I have to confirm. I am ghost to one of the original 32. I eat ghouls that only one are coming after you. It's new time, but I get my spotlight. Because my life isn't exactly right. continue to repeat. My measures made me constantly dismayed, so I betrayed my allies and sided with Speltham, so the Van Stormblade, a supercharge, I believe, made me realize my mistake, and I perceived to blow up Speltham, so I am ghost to one of the original 32. I eat ghouls that only one are coming after you. It's new time, but I get my spotlight, because my life isn't exactly right. Imaginators. I was pushing, but I never took a path in life. Now in strife, I instead eat cheesy puffs, and I thrive on playing Call of Duty. Um, Ghost Roaster? I'm not sure if that last verse was canon. So? Do I care? Yeah, I think I've seen enough today.